Welcome to Wildcat Books. My name is Lexi. I want to introduce you to some of my pets. This is my cat Josie, Miss Peach, Claire, and some of my cows whom I love so much. I love all of my pets so much. But one of the saddest things about being a pet owner is that as your pets grow old, they pass away. It's a part of the circle of life. But I want to introduce you to Evan and his pet dog in the book, The Rough Patch, written and illustrated by Brian Lies. Evan and his dog did everything together. They played games and enjoyed sweet treats. They shared music and adventure. They were together all through the day and through all the seasons. But what they loved the most was working in Evan's magnificent garden. There, everything they planted grew as big and as beautiful as the sky above them. But one day, the unthinkable happened. Evan laid his dog to rest in a corner of the garden and nothing was the same. Evan shut himself away inside without his best friend. The garden was a bitter and lonely place. One morning, he found himself with a hoe in his paws. Swinging angrily, he slashed the garden to the ground. He hacked it all to bits and threw everything into a heap. But a good place won't stay empty for long. New plants sprouted and stretched toward the sky. Weeds, itchy ones, spiky and prickly ones, foul smelling ones. These weeds suited Evan just fine. So he took care of them. If Evan's garden couldn't be a happy place, then it was going to be the saddest and most desolate spot he could make it. And soon it was. When Evan found a pumpkin vine sneaking in under the fence, he raised his hoe to chop it. But then he considered its prickly stems, fuzzy leaves, and spidery, twisty tendrils. He let it be. As the pumpkin vine grew, Evan cleared the weeds from its path and watered it. The vine responded to his care. Around the time the evening air began to cool, Evan felt an old, familiar sense of excitement. It was fair week. He loaded up the pumpkin and drove to town. He took care of important fair business and gobbled down some delicious fair food. He caught up with some old friends too. It felt good to be out again, even if it wasn't quite the same. Evan's pumpkin won third place. Prize is $10 or one of the pups in that box, the judge said. Which prize do you think Evan chose? Did he choose the $10 or the puppy? If you'd like to find out, feel free to check out this book in your local library. Thanks for watching.